Bradley, when you're uh, working in the in the trenches in a game that's you know closing in on four and a half hours, I mean, even now a couple days later, how are you guys feeling physically? Like right now or after the game? <laughs> well, I guess right now that you've had a little time to recover. Um, yeah, I feel really good. You know, just moving on to the next week and you know getting ready for Kent State and going and uh, playing out that game. So. How nice is it to have today off then from a full practice? Oh, it, it's it's very nice. It's the first time we had off in a while. So. <laughs> this uh, the evolution of this running game. Uh, you, you know, obviously last year it was a lot of Derek and, and you know not so much of quarterback options. And uh, it's this year to have Jalen and Damian and, and all the guys back there. Um, how much has it evolved since last year? Uh, it's definitely you know it's it's evolved a little bit you know from. Coker to Jalen, it's it's a little bit of difference between them two, but uh, you know it, it's it's been good for us. So you know Jalen's a very good athlete, and you know hopefully we can keep continuing. So schematically, do you guys have to change much of what you do on the line when you have a more mobile quarterback? Uh, not really. It's still the same the same pace. Uh, you know we block for the running back. If one guy squeezes, the quarterback pulls it and he runs his thing. So. Brandon, how big was it that Ole Miss, what a year, a couple of years ago, you stepped in for Ryan uh, and played some, in that experience going back and playing center now? Oh, that was, you know, that was my first big time uh, plays there. And, uh, you know, it's great to be able to go back into that stadium and walk away this time with a completely different uh, mindset from it, you know, coming out with a, a victory against them. It's a very tough place to get a win. What about helping your development now every game? Plan then to so, what are you asking? About helping you develop now as a center from then, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, just from then to yeah. now. Yeah, it, I mean, it's, you know, over the course of two years, it's, there's a lot of time for development and, you know, people coming in and helping and uh, so on like that. And, you know, definitely I've, you know, I've gotten stronger, gotten wiser, you know, really developed my play from there. So. You said it doesn't change blocking for a running back as, as it is for a running quarterback, but with uh, Jalen's ability to extend plays, you never know when a second block from you might happen. How, is that communication from him? I know in a couple of them, I, you know, he was pointing downfield for somebody to make a block. Sometimes with an offensive line, it could be the same thing. Talk a little bit about that, that it ex extending plays means a second block or a third block sometimes for a line. Yeah, you know, it's, it's always you go into the whistle blows. So, you know, whether that's finish your guy uh, to the ground or coming off and going to make another block, you're always hustling to the ball and getting ready to, for the next play. What's it like to be on the sidelines as an offensive player and watch your defense and your special team score? And, you know, what's going through your head? And I guess, does that give you all a boost? Yes, for sure it does. Uh, you know, seeing our defense and special teams get three touchdowns, you know, that's, that's huge for us and, you know, puts points and gives us a little bit of breathing room, I guess you'd say. And, uh, you know, they're, they're out there doing what they have to do and we have to get back on the field and do what we have to do to continue our, our progress through the game. Particularly that's when right. you're breaking in a, a lot of newer faces on offenses here. I think defense and special teams is five touchdowns through three games. Does that take almost a little bit of the pressure off you guys while, while you're still developing that chemistry early in the season? Uh, you know, it's it's always good for the team when our defense is scoring. You know, that's just more more points for us. So, <laughs> so yeah, I guess so. Yes, sir. No problem.